Hey YouTube, it's Dimitri, and today we're gonna to talk about using Discord. So I have never used Discord. I know lots of people have used it. I know people have recommended it over the years to me, and I've just been like, eh, it's a bunch of extra work and time, something I just don't have. And yet here we come back around to uh, using a Discord channel here, hopefully to help me reduce some of my time and give you guys a bit more quality and to help build out a more robust quant community here. So at the beginning of the year, we did a quant conference here in Dallas. Again, the purpose is to bring together more quants it is shocking to me how many quants are actually in the Dallas area, for example, um, and just don't know each other. I know this is probably the same in New York City, Chicago, other places. A lot of us just don't meet up. Um, so Discord is hopefully going to bring everyone together. Um, that is gonna be the number one uh, reason for doing this. The number two reason is somewhat selfish on my half, but I would like to create this as a monthly subscription. Um, again, somebody has posted in the comments, maybe have a general Discord channel with a free section, and then also maybe have a you know monthly subscription section with extra content or whatever. Um, but the reason I would like to do Discord and make a membership channel out of this somewhat is to help reduce on the amount of time I have to answer questions. So we are closing in here. By the end of the year, we will have 50,000 subscribers. Um, I have no idea how many messages I've answered over the years. And if we go to my LinkedIn here, you will see I have tons and tons of unread messages and messages in general. I just don't have time to get to. Um, I will click unread here as well, and we can scroll. You can see there's July 31st, uh, July 28th, 27th, 26th, 25th. Um, anyways, it goes... It goes back. I think I'm through like May right now, give or take. And I spend a few hours a week um, just sitting down and going through these messages. Um, some messages are awesome and I appreciate the feedback like, hey, Dimitri, awesome channel. I've been following you for four years or your channel has been a big help. Um, I just landed a job. I wanted to give you an update. I'm working at, you know, this company. And that's awesome. I love those. And those are quick and easy for me, right? It takes 10, 20 seconds to say like, oh, congrats. Like, I'm really excited you guys are actually like, making progress and doing stuff with the channel. Um, so those are great. But then a lot of you want more specific detailed advice, which is also awesome. But it takes me 10, 20, 30 minutes sometimes um, some of you send out resumes for resume reviews. Those take me probably 45 minutes ish. If we message back and forth, we have some conversations. Um, many of you are taking one, two, three, four hours. Um, I've already cut out all video calls in the past, I think two or three years here. I've taken none. I've taken no video calls, no requests, uh, because those suck up a lot more of my time in scheduling and planning as well here. So I think the Discord channel would be great, uh, a great way to be kind of a subscription service um, to kind of come. And if you want me to answer questions, I will do my best to answer you guys because you would be paying members here. Um, we would try to do this, but it would hopefully reduce the amount of people asking questions. So if you really want a question answered and it's of great value to you, you could come to the Discord channel, participate in that. Now, the second piece of this was questions as well is Many of you have very similar questions, if not the exact same questions. And I try to make videos on these so that I can hit the masses, right? I mean, we're at almost 50,000 subscribers. I think we're over like 3 million views or something. Like there are lots of you watching around the world in India and China. Well, unofficially in China, uh, but India and all over Europe and South America and Africa. Um, and of course, the US and Canada and Mexico and a bunch of other places like we have a huge group here and I'm trying to distribute this as freely as possible without taking up all of my time because um, there's only so much of me to go around. And so I think Discord would be a great way to do this. Um, what do you guys think in the comments though? Like, let me know. I would love for this to be this great community that we're building out um, that people can share ideas in chat. And if you're going to be a dick and you're going to be mean and nasty on the channel, I'm just going to kick people off. Um, unfortunately, the YouTube channel, as it gets larger and larger, and as I make sometimes more general videos, um, it attracts uh, a lot of haters that come onto the channel here uh, and gripe and complain and everything else. So this might be kind of a good quality position to ask your questions. Like you guys would be shocked how many people out there um, in the quant community are willing to answer questions. I know it's hard to find those individuals, but we could bring them into the Discord channel as well. Um, a lot of you that are not technically industry practitioners have great information to share as well. So, you know, imagine you're graduating undergrad. You're like, what masters do I choose? I'm looking at this specific program. These are my 10 concerns. I can give you guys some perspective, but I can't give you a lot. Uh, somebody else might already be in that master's or just graduated or graduated three, four years ago. They're going to be able to come in and say, hey, this was, you know, the pros, the cons, everything of this this program, this is what I like, this is what I didn't like. I would recommend it or I would not recommend it. Um, again, it would be a nice kind of close-knit community here um, 
with good solid quality quant. So anyways, I'd love to hear what you guys think in the comments below. Again, I'm trying to keep the content as free as possible. Um, my time is stretched so thin now, I'm having to just like let go. And what I just showed was my LinkedIn. I also have a bunch of emails as well in the emails for the channel. Um, so that's another thing. And then people contact me on a bunch of other social media platforms as well. It is hard to keep everything lined up, schedules, planning, uh, guest interviews, podcasts, um, all these coming through my LinkedIn, right? So I'm trying to shuffle and organize everything. But I love your guys' comments below. Uh, maybe we'll set up this Discord. I will put out a link if we end up doing this. I'm still just playing with the idea and trying to get everything set up here. But I think this might be a solution uh, to help kind of give you guys more quality content. So anyways, thanks for listening. Thanks for watching. And as always, until next time. Thank you.